Hi everyone, welcome back. Have you ever heard of the world's smallest motor? Yes, uh, the Swiss researchers of EMPA was able to create the smallest motor in the world. This molecular motor consists of only 16 atoms in it. And if you see the diameter of this molecular motor, it is 1 lakh times smaller than the diameter of human hair. As we already know that in a motor we can find a starter and a rotor here. In this molecular motor also consists of starter and rotor. The starter is made with the combination of 6 palladium atoms and 6 gallium atoms. So total of 12 atoms which are arranged in a triangular shape and the remaining 4 atoms by which the rotor is made is from acetylene molecule. In these 4 atoms, 2 are of carbon atoms and 2 are protons. Here, in this rotor, this rotor rotates on the surface of starter. As we know that for a motor to rotate it needs energy. Here, this molecular motor can also can be driven by both electrical and thermal energy. As it is a molecular motor, very tiny amount of electrical energy is required to rotate. So a very small amount of electrical energy is sent into the motor from electron scanning microscope which makes the rotor to rotate a sixth of its revolution in particular direction. But if too much of energy than required is provided which leads to random motion of the rotor than particular direction. As, it, as I already told, it also works on the thermal energy. The temperature less than 17 degree Kelvin that is below minus 256 degrees Celsius the rotor will rotate in one direction but if the temperature increases this makes the rotor to rotate in random direction so what we can and what we have understood that electricity below 30 millivolt and temperature below minus 256 degree Celsius is the required condition for the molecular motor to rotate in particular direction. And now what is the another surprising thing that came to know that this molecular motor as we already know in the physics for an object to move it should overcome the resistance then only an object can move but here if you observe this molecular motor below 30 millivolt and also less than minus 256 degrees celsius also this rotor rotates now coming to the quantum physics the particle can also go for tunneling means according to second law of thermodynamics any particle in tunneling will not lose its energy neither it will increase its energy nor it will decrease its energy at the same time particle will move in random direction but here what we can observe that what is the surprising thing we can observe that this molecular motor is losing its energy at the same time it is moving in one direction in the tunneling event i hope you have understood a brief explanation about this world's smallest motor to know more about the smallest motor the published paper i'll be keeping a link in the description you can click that link and you can know more about the motor thank you if you like my video please share the video at the same time subscribe my channel thank you bye